solve the following differential equation. So this is a homogeneous linear differential equation with constant coefficients. So we'll start by writing down the characteristic equation. That's a 4. So here, we put a 4. That's the fourth derivative. Plus, this is the third derivative. So here we have m cubed. Plus, uh, this is the second derivative. So here we have m squared. And we set this equal to 0. So uh, this is called the characteristic equation. And the first step is to find the roots of this equation. So to solve this, looks like we can factor out m squared. So we end up with m squared plus m plus 1 equals 0. Now this piece here is easy. This is easy. Because here we get m equals 0 and the multiplicity is 2. Remember we need the multiplicity uh, in order to get the solution. Now this here, we set this equal to 0. Uh, it doesn't look like it factors nicely to me. I can't do it in my head. So we'll use the quadratic formula. Quadratic formula. All right, so a here is 1, b here is 1, c here is also 1. So then x is negative b, so negative 1, plus or minus the square root b squared. That's 1 minus 4ac, so minus 4 all over 2 times 1, so 2. So we end up with negative 1 half, negative one half plus or minus i square root 3 over 2. So I skipped a lot of steps here. I broke it up. It's negative 1 over 2. That's that. Plus or minus. This is the square root of negative 3. That gives you i square root of 3. And then it's divided by 2. So to finish, so let's finish. The final answer is y equals, well, let's deal with this first. So here, m equals 0 is a root of multiplicity 2. So we have c1 e to the 0x plus c2x e to the 0x. You have two terms because it's multiplicity 2. Plus, now here we have complex conjugate solutions. So we have c sub 3 e to the negative 1 half x cosine parentheses, square root of 3 over 2x, plus c sub 4, e to the negative 1 half x, sine, parentheses, square root of 3 over 2x. Let's clean this up, and we are done. So y, well, e to the 0 is 1, so you just get c1 plus c2x, because e to the 0 was 1, plus c sub 3, nothing is changing here, just copy pasting, cosine, parentheses, square root of 3 over 2, x, plus c sub 4, e to the negative 1 half x, sine, parentheses, square root of 3 over 2, x. And that is the final answer. So this was a fourth degree differential equation, but it was pretty easy because it was homogeneous and linear.